hello. I have not filmed a voiceover in a minute. Don't worry, we will get to real time talking in a second, but I just wanted to do a voiceover of me flipping through what I'll be using this week. I am using the Friend in Me kit. This is the ultimate kit, it's still available in the shop. Also using the glitter header, the 15 millimeter washi add-on along with a ton of foil i wanted to do mixed metals mixed metals items we do have a core collection in the shop under a mixed metal listing and then i just pulled in other gold and silver items along with these gold and silver rose colored days date covers super cute and i also pulled in a ton of once more with love munchkins i showed those in the beginning i got to pick these up whenever i went to marg's wedding marg of once more with love i got to visit the once more with love headquarters and i picked up my order pretty much she told me to fill my order so i opened up my email and i filled my order so it was the super fastest speediest order delivery Ever. It was like 24 hours and I was hyped. So I went ahead and used the bottom washi. I used the 15 millimeter brown one that is available as an a la carte item. I did put down the left side a little bit crooked, but I didn't feel like, you know, getting another overlay and another 15 millimeter strip. And also, I did use bougie boxes this week. I'm probably going to use bougie boxes for the rest of my life. I love the way they look. I know they're not for everybody. They're, and also, a cheaper alternative would be the half-cut headers. Or you could even do this, like the, the some white space, without using anything in the background and just like always writing on a sticker. And it still kind of gives the same look. I personally just like bougie boxes because in real life, it looks so cool. I did do both silver and gold bougie boxes and kind of like scattered them and I kind of realized why in the past I've done like days with the different colored bougie boxes rather than like scattering them every other throughout like a checkerboard um but I still think it looks good especially because the bougie boxes are kind of like minimal so you don't really notice as much but I just love this kit I think it is super super cute kind of like toy story themed kit um so dang cute i love the way it turned out especially with the mixed metals which was a suggestion from from emily one of my employees and it turned out adorable and i'm so glad i did it in mixed metals but mixed metals is so much dang work again i use these rose color days date covers and i thought they looked really cute doing every other silver and gold and then i just went ahead and worked on my sidebar and i put down one a squared off half box a full box well a full box a squared off half box a full box the extra little piece of the 15 millimeter washi and a fancy label with the box that's on the washi page with the quote to infinity and beyond is that what it says yes and i thought that looked really really cute that is currently i believe on my pr freebie so if you're looking to get that and whenever i decided to do mixed metals i decided to do the mixed metal star so there is mixed metal star headers and mixed metal star overlay boxes which are super duper cute and then i just used the mini stars as deco throughout and i think it looked absolutely gorgeous and i didn't use any deco at the top or no maybe i did i don't remember i guess you'll have to wait and see so let's go ahead and get into the day by day planning i feel like this is like the ultimate level of ridiculous pre-planning. So just like as a little explanation for this week, I am doing mixed meals. I think I probably mentioned that in the little voiceover that I'm gonna do that I haven't done yet, but I am doing mixed metals. So mixed metals is a little bit more of an extensive task because I wanna make sure I am have like an even amount of metals throughout. Um, I pulled all of my character stickers. I did a lot this week because Jessica came to visit Toy Story this week, so I wanted to use a lot of Toy Story stickers. Once More Love did come out with the most perfect Toy Story character sheets. I have been wanting Toy Story character sheets from somebody, and Marg delivered. I helped her because she didn't even know who Forky was, and she didn't know who Zerg was, and I was like, you're a fake fan. But I also pulled out some scripts. I usually put everything on here, but there was just literally no room so i pulled out some scripts in both silver and gold foil and i just ripped out this little sheet from my other book and then i use these pads that i sell in the shop here they are here's one of them 
They look like this, and they have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then a blank spot. And I use those every week. I have next week's already started. Um, and then I just use some highlighters, and for the gold stuff, I did pink, and then the silver stuff, I did blue, just so whenever I was pulling the stickers, I could remember what was above it because I wanted to kind of go every other. Hopefully, that doesn't mess up at all, but... We shall see. So let's go ahead and get into this week. Very busy week. Actually, I didn't realize I was still in Vancouver on Monday morning. I always forget that it's, it's a little more complicated than just like having this here. Um, I also have to pull out this stuff. So it's a little bit of an older kit, so it's like a little bit older format. So let's see. I have four things to put in. On Monday, I was still in Vancouver, so I think what I'm going to do is put in, um, probably I'm going to use book labels actually, maybe the blue one. I'm going to put in that I went to this place, I think it was called like D-O-U-C-E, Deuce Diner, in Vancouver to, for breakfast. We went with, I was staying with Aura Estelle, so I went with her and her family. And obviously Bubba and Nick too. That was kind of like our farewell. And then I'm going to go ahead and use little things I think for the rest of the things. So let's go ahead and do one in here for packing up. One in we got McDonald's on the way to Marg's house. We wanted to go to Marg's house to see her new house. And just to visit. That up a little bit. I'm going to put the characters down then. And then I'm going to go ahead and put down another one for Marg's house. I think I'm actually going to use this strip here. I don't think a appointment label will fit. Actually, well, so I'm going to use the appointment label. Sometimes I forget, like, how much room there is. And I'm like, oh, yeah, I can only fit, like, one and then some little things. So let me grab my little scissors. And thank you for all the compliments on my nails recently. I've been really loving them. I feel so much more professional. I have a really cool nail idea that I saw on the Instagram for my next nails, which will be my like Hawaii nails, um, which I hope you guys love. I'm like obsessed, like so excited. I was looking at so many beach nails and they all were like not my favorite, but I found ones that I love. So both of these stickers are from Paper and Milk. This one's for packing up. Uh, we had a lot of packing up to do. I feel like we had a million suitcases and we actually like came home with less because most of the stuff like diapers and stuff we packed just because we didn't feel like going and getting and Bubba's skin sensitive so they didn't have the exact ones, blah, 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 you know. And then for going to Marg's house, I think I'm going to use this bunny sticker. This is from Toy Story 4. I just wanted to use some Toy Story 4 stickers kind of just like thrown around in the spread so I thought it would be super cute. Then I wanted to put in that we went to get Hot Pot with, um, I think I'll do it with a blue, with Marg and Tom. Tom is Marg's husband now, so weird to say because Marg is now married. Um, so we got to go to Hot Pot, me, Nick, Bennett, Marg, and Tom. So that was really delicious and I'm using these paper and milk chopsticks. Thought I had Hot Pot stickers, but I don't know where they went, so that's what I'm using. Then I wanted to put in that we went to the Once More With Love headquarters. And I'm going to use, actually, which I do. Let's do the bottom one first, which is going to be for we slept at the airport. Uh, like the airport hotel, which is actually really nice. They just have redid the area that we stayed in. And can I fit this? Yes. And then this is for visiting the Once More With Love headquarters, which gave me a lot of anxiety but don't worry I'm gonna help Mark help her out so I'm gonna use the little passport for staying in the Ooh, actually I had a Duke boom out from Mark's headquarters but I kind of feel like the what's that called the seal of disapproval would make more sense I think that's under emotions negative possibly might take me a minute to find but I feel like the seal of disapproval would make the most sense because that was me oh yeah seal of disapproval and this is also from Marg she will get a laugh oops so I actually have too many of these so I have to separate them and choo -choo. 
so funny. I'll save Duke Kaboom, and if I don't have a place for him, I will find a place to stick him. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that in there. The passport sticker is from Paper and Milk. I could have like saved the passport and dig the Duke Kaboom sticker down here. Let's do that and see what happens. Yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna go ahead and chop his legs off. Just because this is for a little thing, so I don't have a ton of space. Somebody just text me. Yes, Nicholas texted me. I had to wait for everyone to leave work to film, and it is 8.15. He said Bubba is being miserable tonight, which is weird. Then on Tuesday, I have in three things in the morning, which makes sense. So I we did wake up really early. So for that, I'm just going to put in a little thing. Let's do the gray one for waking up super early. I feel like we slept for like three hours. It was actually a pretty pleasant plane ride with Bennett. It was like a layover. So we had two flights. The one was kind of miserable and the other one wasn't too bad. Then I'm going to go ahead and use another see let's use the blue for getting Starbucks at the airport and then for the flight I think I'm gonna use maybe a half box possibly maybe or maybe a squared off no it's a lot of blue together um, I'm gonna use the this color one it's light gray here and I'm just gonna center this in the middle. I was gonna think about doing this and then putting like, let's do that actually. All right, let's grab a little piece of washi. I'm gonna grab the this darker gray and I'm just gonna cut a little piece off. Cause it was a lot of day that flight. So for the Starbucks, I do have out the Bella Bear Studios sticker. I did pull out a gold Starbucks sticker. This is from Letters to Apollo at Starbucks. It was good. There was no line because we got there super, super early. Um, and then for waking up early, I think I grabbed just this super cute little, um, what's his name? Is it Ham? No. What is it? What's his name? I don't remember. I feel like it's Ham, but I'm not sure. So we have that for waking up early. And then for my flight, I do have this sticker from Fox and Pip, which I did this the last week and I really liked it. So I did that. And then I just used what from our mini icon sheet, this super cute little, um, airplane to mark the flight. I thought that was really, really cute. I really love layering stickers recently, but like in love. I'm going to zoom you guys in just a little bit more. So then on the second part of the day, I actually don't have a lot of stuff to put in the second part of the day. So I do have in that we got Chewies for dinner. So for Chewies, I think I'm going to use a Mm, this is a pattern fancy label. I'm going to use the brown in here for Chewies. And for that, I'm going to use this Jessie sticker. I don't even think I'm going to trim her and put that in there. And then last but not least, I do have in that I worked on um, labels. I could probably, I think I also filmed this day, I feel like. So what I wanted to try doing for work is um, taking a piece of washi. So probably these, this row here. So for this one, I'll use the blue to try it out, I guess. And then taking the character sticker and putting it on here. And then doing the work sticker next to it and then placing it down like this and I honestly don't have anything to put here I might just like think about it a little more and then like come back to it at the end of the video let me actually open this up because it's starting to get a little fat 
My planner is so fat, guys. Do you guys want me to do a flip through or not? I think down here I might actually put in that I filmed because I'm pretty sure I filmed. I think I'm going to use a piece of washi. Maybe I'll do another one from here or maybe I'll do one of these. Does it matter? Would that be weird? What did I do? What can I put in? I'm just going to leave it till the end. Probably going to lie and put something in or see if I have a countdown I could put in or something. I don't know. We'll see. On Wednesday, I put in sleep in and then let's see. For sleep in, I'm just going to use a fancy label. I'll use the gray one. For sleep in, I did bring this super cute Fox and Pip sticker. I am going to trim her down quite a bit because she is very large and in charge. So I'm going to trim her down. I don't even know where to put this. It's so big right here. She's super cute though. So for this, I'm going to put sleep in. Let's put it over here. And then I did pull out a sleep in script in silver. Then I wanted to put in that it was Wiggle Wednesday. So for that, I do have a label from the shop, from the SPC label sheet. I do have scripts too. I'm just gonna kind of switch it up, I think. Then I'm gonna put in that I did work again on labels. So for that, this was from Once Worth Love, by the way. Um, for that, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a piece of washi. I'm gonna use this one. And again, I'm just gonna take the uh, this one I pulled for labels I did the fox and cactus girl so I'm going to put her in here and then for work I have the gold work sticker and then last but not least I wanted to put in that I facetimed Jessica is that the order I want to do it? Hmm. <laughs> Maybe I might, I might put print inserts here because I was on the phone with Jessica when I was printing inserts. So for printing inserts, I am just going to use a little thing. Let's grab one and I'm going to use the blue. This is turning out really, really cute. Not going to lie. I am in love with it. Okay, so that in there. And then for printing inserts, I think I'm going to use um, Rex. I don't know why all of a sudden I'm like not confident in the names right now. I don't know the other dinosaurs are Trixie, so that's kind of good. And then I did want to put in, like I said, that I FaceTimed Jessica. So for that, I do have a FaceTime Jessica sticker. It is kind of bigger than I would probably put in FaceTime, but I'm just going to go ahead and put it in one of these third labels. I think it'll fit pretty nicely. And for FaceTiming Jessica, I am going to use, let's see, I guess I'll use the Mr. Potato Head, which is super cute, right there. And I'm going to put in the FaceTime Jessica, and Jessica was like, she texted me, I think it was, she texted me and was like, I'm so bored, blah, 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 blah. And then I called her, and I was like, why don't you just come see me? And she was like, oh, that's a good idea. And then we just booked her flight. And yeah, Bubba was sick, so I couldn't, he couldn't do much, so I didn't feel bad just being like, see you later, fam. Jessica is coming to town. So Jessica came and, well, we decided Jessica was coming on this day, and then I wanted to put in that Bennett slept for 17 hours this day, which was, in my opinion, quite impressive of him. He, like I said, wasn't feeling really well since, like, I think it was like Sunday he started to feel sick. Saturday night wasn't feeling too good. And I think it was like the travel and then he had um, croup, which is kind of like a respiratory infection, I think, of sorts. So we're actually supposed to go to Elle's house this week, Elle Glam Planner. Her son's birthday was, um, like his birthday party was supposed to be this week, but we canceled because we didn't want him to get croup. I don't mess around with kids like getting sick, but it did start feeling well on like Friday-ish, but I, I don't know. It just, this is too much. And then also Baba traveling, I didn't want him to get him more sick. So I was like, it's not going to happen. Um, and we canceled, but we probably will be going 
soon because the boys are close in age, so it's pretty nice. Then I wanted to put in that we went to Phil's Ice House this day just for a quick little dinner. And then last but not least, I did tidy up the um, office a little bit, so I'm just going to grab this. I did pull out a tidy up sticker. I just don't think it's going to fit, but I brought out this Fox and Cactus Girl with the moving box. Again, this is like a little bit bigger, so I am going to trim her, but I just wanted to tidy up my personal office space because there's stuff everywhere. So I'm going to grab her and put her in. I feel like I cut her kind of weird, but let's just go ahead and trim this little edge off here perfecto so that is from fox and cactus paper and milk and then of course we have a bunch of stickers from once more club because i love mark and she my favorite now we're going to go ahead and actually let's do the sidebar real quick so the first thing that i wanted to put in the sidebar before i forgot is that jessica came this week so for that i do have this duck sticker if you guys watched it um the toy story or you've seen any of the trailers you may or may not know that jessica and i are duck and bunny jessica is duck and i am bunny or ducky and bunny then i also wanted to put in that wizards unite oops wizards unite came out this week so uh jessica and i did like have like a little craft day and figure out how to uh foil some stickers so we have these which i made for me jessica and kirsten emily is not playing wizards unite like I was saying, Emily doesn't play Wizards Unite, or we would have made her some too, but she doesn't, so we didn't. But we uh, just foiled these. Uh, in the dark, they don't look that bad. In the studio lights, it's not a great foiling job. Then I also did put in that Toy Story 4 came out this week. Not that I can't tell from the spread, but I figured I had room. And then I also decided what I wanted to put here. So I did go home to a ton of packages because I was gone for forever so i'm gonna go ahead and put in do I do a square box maybe be cute what did i do here oh no so i have these highlighters that are like gel highlighters and they got everywhere that's okay though because i just won't use that one it's kind of annoying though but yeah it's like a gel chunk highlighters it's everywhere it's on some of my foil stickers too but i'll live so I have this box and cactus sticker with a bunch of boxes, which I normally don't ma mark like mail. So I guess that was pretty cute. So on Thursday, I wanted to put in that I went and got my nails done in the morning with Emily. Um, so let's put that in, I think, with a quarter box in brown. Not playing Wizards Unite this plan with me because I just ranked up to level 15. So I was like, I'm gonna give myself a little bit of a break and just not look at it for a little bit. So for that, I'm gonna be using a Scribbler sticker, but I've been loving Wizards Unite. I think it is so fun. Been hanging out with friends a lot more than normal with because of it. Uh, nail appointment here. I'll just remember it was with Emily because I remember these things. Then on after that, I did work. I did film some things. So I think I'm going to use a piece of washi and do the little layering bit for filming. I'm going to use, um, yeah, I'm going to drop. Let's use this one. I'm going to use these paper mill Polaroids, which I did order more of because I kind of like them for this. Um, I just think they're super cute. So let's put that one in there. And then I do have a film in gold. Am I in gold? I hope so, yes. In gold. Super cute. I'm gonna put that under here. I feel like I'm gonna run out of room. And then I also wanted to put in that I played Wizards Unite. So I have a Wizards Unite sticker. Kind of trying to figure out what I wanna do here. Do I wanna just like put it in? Or I guess I could put in maybe a quarter box sure i think that'll fit it will i'm gonna lift this up a little bit like i said before these wizards i don't think i'm planning on selling the wizards unite stickers just because i feel like they're a little niche to place an order for them um 
So yeah, I don't think I plan on selling them. But if I see somebody else selling Wizard Unite stickers or if somebody is selling them, let me know. Um, but maybe I will depending on like, I guess it's like Brian's always making points about how like popular Pokemon is. So maybe it'll like stick around. Maybe I should make one. I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below. Maybe I'll do a poll on Instagram. So after I played Wizards Unite, I did go see Toy Story 4. So for that, I am going to use, let's see. I'm going to use the, I don't know if I'm to put that right there then. I should have really thought about that a little more. Maybe I'll put Target above it and Wizards Unite below it, even though I did them in the opposite way. I'm going to use one of these. So I went to see Toy Story with Nick actually went to the fan event at the Alamo Draft House, which was super fun. So for going to Target, I did just pull out this Bo Peep sticker in her new costume. Bo Peep is so pretty, um, like like how porcelain she is. I just think it's a really good like look. It's so detailed. So I got to put that for Toy Story, and then I got this Sid sticker for Toy Story 4. Obviously doesn't really like make a ton of sense here, but I did actually wear a Sid shirt to the um, premieres. I thought that that would be really cute. I wore my Sid shirt tucked into my long pleated black maxi dress and the kid next to me really liked it. So um, I call that a win. Then I wanted to put in that I did go to work and I did film and overnight. I did listings. So let's go ahead and put that in with a piece of pattern washi. This time I will use the blue and I'm just gonna go ahead and grab this and do the, where's my other stickers go? No, I don't know how many times I could lose stickers in one, y'all. Okay, there. For this one I'm gonna use the silver work. So cute. And that way I get like some more labels by using the pattern washi for this. Love it. That is so cute. Then on Friday, I did have Starbucks and Holy Bagel in the morning. So for that, um, Holy Bagel is just like a bagel place that we love. It's good if you're, you live in Austin and then you want a bagel. We recommend. So for that, I'm just going to put in this sticker here. This is just a like drink, ice drink sticker from Paper and Milk. Then I wanted to put in the new releases sticker. I'm again using from the SPC labels sheet. But like I said, I do have scripts that say new releases. So kind of going to switch it up. Then I did have a lash appointment. I did have a eyelash, I mean a nail appointment this day. And um, the girl who's doing my nails convinced me to get my eyelashes done. So for that, I'm going to use, I think a brown label, but I got my eyelashes done a while back, probably like two years ago at this point. It was way before I had Bennett or way, I think it was way before I had, was even pregnant with Bennett. Um, this is a Once More With Love sticker, and I really just feel like a million bucks when I have my eyelashes on. Like, I just feel, like, put together and, like, just all around better, uh, like, my confidence-wise. So, I got them done, and I am very, very happy with the outcome of that. And then for Wizards Unite, I think I'm going to use an appointment label. That's, like, the biggest option I have. I feel like it's going to stick off of this a little bit, but that's okay. And then I have a Silver Wizards Unite sticker, and I'm using a Wizard Scribbler with that. Actually, that fits kind of good. Wizards Unite. And then that was actually with Brian and Kirsten. I played with them. Then we went to dinner at North with Brian and Kirsten. So for that, I'm going to use a... Let's see. I think I'm going to use the nope. See that? Yeah, I think so. This squared off box, maybe? Mm. And then put ice cream above it. We went to get ice cream. A new ice cream place opened. And every time I've driven past since, it's like way too busy to even think about it. 
but open up at the domain if you feel like waiting forever for some ice cream it is hershey's ice cream which is kind of like what i grew up on so it's kind of nostalgic but yeah i don't know i don't think it's like that good but let's use that and then this one here for work so i'm gonna put in for ice cream i do have just this really cute slinky dog sticker which i am going to trim like i said Obviously, it doesn't make any sense for the ice cream, but just because it's like a Toy Story kit, which sometimes I do with Disney, I like to just use a bunch of character stickers that kind of like fit into the theme. Then for North, I did have a salad. I was actually kind of disappointed. I, we, Nick and I like didn't say anything to each other when we were there, but then whenever we, I got home, I was like, babe, like, I just feel like really disappointed with the salad today. And he's like, yo, me too. And I was like, that's so strange. Like, that we were both like disappointed no he didn't have a salad but like we were both just maybe he did yeah he did we were both disappointed with our meal from north which usually we love north but we never really go for dinner so we think that it might have been the dinner we're gonna give them another shot before we just say that they have went downhill but i really like north and was kind of disappointed in the salad the bread kind of everything this time so kind of bummed about that but it's okay then on saturday i did clean in the morning so for cleaning i'm just going to use a little thing also haven't fully decided what i plan on doing with the little thing situation i did do a poll and most people said i could take off the icon and i was thinking i could do like sheets of like just the icon cut out on white paper with um on clear paper with white like icons but i don't know yet i'm still like debating um but you guys like the majority didn't care so i don't know then i wanted to put in that i picked up jessica at the airport for that i am going to use i think a quarter box possibly yeah i'm gonna use a quarter box for that i do have this super super cute little like friends sticker that i love from whimsical can studio i think so i'm gonna put that in and then we did go to walmart and to mcdonald's so for that, I'm going to use, oof, I don't know, man. Let's do this one for Walmart. And then this one for McDonald's. We were going to go to Cobble Bob's, but then there was a long line. The Chick-fil-A line was in the street. And then we were like, oh my goodness, we could get a Happy Meal because we did a Happy Meal date in New York. And we were like, oh, we get a Happy Meal. And then we were like, Toy Story toys. We probably waited just as long as we would have for Cabo Bob's. But that's okay. I had Cabo Bob's today and it was delicious. So for going to um, McDonald's, I'm going to use this little alien guy. We did get an alien toy. We got the alien toy and what other toy did we get? I put these on wrong, but... Um... We got the alien toy and I don't know. As of right now, I think we have the alien toy, Forky, Bo Peep. We might have Buzz Lightyear, I think might have been the other one. Not 100% sure, but we went to Walmart and did it up. So let's put this in. Fun fact, um, Buzz is actually Bennett's favorite character. He's the only one... Besides the Mickey Mouse, it's the only one he like really recognizes. And then I have this toy soldier one to put in for Walmart. It's the one he like, only one he like really recognizes besides Mickey Mouse. He like loves Mickey Mouse. And we're Mickey Mouse all the time. And he's always like, Mickey Mouse. And I'm like, yep, that's him. Um, so after that, I wanted to put in four things down here. The thing I wanted to put on the bottom is Wizards Unite, which I'm going to put that in first. I think everything else I might be able to fit in on little things so for wizards unite i'm going to use this squared off box actually i don't want to use that squared off box or do i want to use the squared off box i'm probably going to use the squared off box it's just like a lot of blue there but i'll get over it so let's put this in here then i think i'm going to use little things for the rest so i will put in this one for barbecue we had like a barbecue like a cookout then oh barbecue step the script the script is not going to fit on there mm, board games isn't going to fit on here either Ugh, i might just write it in instead of doing scripts 
which is a sad day for me, but it is okay. All right, let's see what we can do. So for Wizards Unite, I pulled out this Dumbledore sticker because I thought it was really funny from Paper and Milk. And then for Wizards Unite, I have this script. For the s'mores, I have the um, Paper and Milk s'more. And then for board games, I do have this uh, card game sticker. He plays Cards Against Humanities and Racco. Humanities? Humanity and then Racco, which is a real fun game. But we've been playing um, Cards Against Humanities with Nick's mom, and she's hilarious. Literally hilarious. Every time we crack up. Then for scripts, I did pull out barbecue, but I feel like, I mean, I guess I can make it work. Looks a little weird, but we're going to roll with it. And then I also pulled out game night, which again would look really weird, but you know what? I'm going to roll with it. We're just being a little out of the box ish. Um, then uh, I'm going to put in actually, I totally forgot this. For Jessica at the airport, I did pull out this silver plane. Okay, I think that's everything. Then on Sunday, we did pick up Amanda at the airport. She posted on Instagram that she, like if anybody could give her a ride from the airport. And we were like, yes, we can do that. So let's go ahead and grab a fancy label for that. We're picking up Amanda at the airport. We also went over to her house and gave her decorating advice, unsolicited, of course, um, but she appreciated it. So, for picking up Amanda, I have this cute little munchkin sticker, and again, I did pull out another. Okie dokie. So, have a little foiled sticker there, and then I wanted to put in that we went to. Target. So for Target, I think I'm going to use another pattern fancy label. No, I use, I guess I use a, yeah, I'm going to use a pattern fancy label. I have a lot of room here. Okay, I think for Target, I'm going to use a little thing. Where, I was like, where are my little things? Let's do... This one here for going to Target. And I do have a Forky sticker for that, just because I thought it was pretty cute. Forky is hilarious. Such a good movie. So let's put that in there. And then I wanted to put in that we played Wizards at the Domain. So for that, can I fit a half box? Nope. For that, I think I'm going to use... Oh boy. We got a lot of them here. Why are you putting play with Bennett? I don't think that'll fit either. I really didn't think about this prior. I might actually just make this. Let's do this. Let's grab this up. Oops, sorry, Porky. Let's grab this. I feel like you'd think the nails would be helpful in this situation, but they're really not. Okay. Oops. All right. Let's grab this. Undo. It's so much a pain to look. So we're just going to do this. All right. So what are we doing? Let's grab one of these. For picking Amanda up. Oops. In there just squish it till it works and then we'll grab this guy here put him in we're going to target and use the little forky sticker like I said and then for playtime with Bubba I'm gonna grab a pattern box I'll use the half box for playtime with Bubba and for that I did grab the Buzz Lightyear sticker, because like I said, Buzz is his favorite character. And I'm going to use the Playtime with Bennett. He hasn't actually watched Toy Story the whole way through, but he loves Buzz. And then underneath that, I'm going to put in that we went and played Wizards at the Domain. And for that, I'm just going to use this fancy label. 
And did I even, oh yeah, I grabbed the Hagrid sticker. Cause I thought, again, that was pretty funny. A gold Wizards Unite sticker. It has a little bit of that gel highlighter on it that I used. Then I put in that we took selfies at the domain. So I'm just gonna grab this sticker here for that. I have this, which is a Once More With Love munchkin. I guess they weren't selfies. We were like taking pictures of each other. It was a real fun time. We were like, we look cute, so why not? And we had, because we had a little bit of time, we were playing Wizards before going to our dinner reservation. For dinner, we did go to Perry's, which is a, um, it's kind of like a steakhouse, I guess, but they, they're known for like their pork chop. So I have this like plate of food. And then last but not least, I wanted to put in that we went to see Toy Story for again, just because we loved it so, 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 so much. And for that, I'm just gonna grab, what do I wanna use for that? I thought I had, I just wanna use the blue label. Er, let's use this one. Er, yeah, yeah, let's use this one. So we made a like pretty late movie um movie tickets but and honestly I wouldn't go back to a late movie I just feel like everyone wasn't as like good about being quiet but yeah so that is that I think I think I think I think that's everything that I wanted to put into this spread I'm gonna go ahead and zoom you guys out so you can see I don't know where these were supposed to go oh I think I pulled out this tidy up tidy up clean gold up here and then I don't know where oh this one is supposed to go over here and then I have a, a rogue film but I think I'm just gonna leave that be so that is everything for this week probably not going to use deco this week i kind of want to but i kind of feel like it looks kind of good up top and my battery's almost dead i am going to go ahead and sprinkle some of these stars up at the top and throughout the spread once i fill it out but like i said last week if you guys want to see the filled out spread whenever i get to posting it which will hopefully be soon follow me over at spc plans but i hope you guys like this week's video and i will talk to you guys in my next one